They had a man, speaking of alcohol and headbutting, they had a black man that, um, that one time we'd go get like taco vodka used to be the kind of vodka that we would drink. It was just like this off brand in our region. Like Todd's almost? Uh, yeah, probably like something like that. Just whatever. like whatever. Every place had their own little local brand or whatever. And this, this was called taco. And so you go get a fifth of taco or whatever. So one time I'll pull up by the um, gas station and they had this man. And I was thinking, oh, this guy will buy some vodka. He looks like he drinks some vodka. And it was daytime, you know, it was probably maybe 11 a.m. So I, I pick it, I say, hey, man, will you get us some liquor? He said, yeah. I said, all right, here's the money. You got to go in and get the liquor. Come back out and get in the car. It was kind of, you got to give exact directions to. Yeah, otherwise, you know? otherwise you're going to deviate from the plan. I buy like some fucking uh, Slim Jims and a pack scratch of cigarettes. Offs, yeah, scratch shoes, offs, shoes, fucking the, the dice. Yeah, yeah <laughs> this dude come out with yeah, shoes. Yeah, fucking, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> um, so anyway, he gets back in the car. He's got the liquor. And that's when this dude told me, he's like, you know, I'm the head button champion of the world, right? <laughs> Last thing you want to hear from, I'm talking this guy, the, the only th- man I've ever seen, yeah. He had that thick head. Oh. <laughs> this guy's head was probably made by that shoemaker, right? <laughs> he had that kind of head. He had a Bigger, shoemaker. Bigger, smaller than Chin's head. Chin's head has a dome on him. It was like Chin's head with another all Chin's forehead, head on top of but it. All yeah. forehead? <laughs> oh, yeah, but all, all forehead, forehead, dude. God damn. Yeah, it was that John the Snowman. It was like stacking up a couple of Chin's <laughs> heads, right? This guy had just... Like you could see his, ne- you could hear his neck. If you put your ear up to his neck, you could his his neck would be like, "Man, I'm tired," you Man, know. I'm exhausted. I'm tired. Yeah. <laughs> and he was headbutting people. No, he goes, "I'm driving us off." He has the vodka, and all my, I want the vodka from him. Right? You're trying to get fucked up. And he goes, "You know, I'm the headbutting champion of the world, right?" And this dude's homeless. Okay, so. <laughs> Did you say, I didn't know there was a competition oh, for yeah. that, sir? And this is before they had it. This is way before. This is uh, 20 years before Kimbo Slice, right? Yeah. And this man looked exactly like Kimbo Slice, right? But, but with, white? With a two-story head. Oh, he's black. But white or black? But black. black. All right. 100% black. And he, so next thing you know, he goes, you know, I'm the head button champion of the world. And you start to see him kind of just looking at me as if I just feel like suddenly. He was sizing up your dome. Yeah, suddenly <laughs> I'm looking forward driving and he's looking directly at me, right? You can feel there it. is no us. We're not going anywhere anymore. He is just in the car with me. And, uh, and so I pull, uh, and he goes, do you want, he goes, do you think you could beat me? And I knew, <laughs> but when he said, do you think anything at that point, I'm already thinking I'm of out. the cops. I'm thinking of my funeral. I'm, I'm thinking of dude I'm in the out. back. Get in! I'm, I'm thinking out. about yeah. I'm gonna fuck yeah. out. But you can't just get out of a car when you're driving it. <laughs> and that's one of the issues with cars. <laughs> is that you have some responsibility to stay in there and at least pull it over. It's yours. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> so I start, I pull over because I'm not gonna get knocked unconscious while I'm moving forward. You know what I'm saying? I'm not a fucking idiot. Yeah. So this dude he goes, you want to know? And he, I know he couldn't even hear me anymore. Though. I'm saying no. He's seeing red. Oh, yeah. It, for him, it's game time. <laughs> yeah, it's game time, dude. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I, I'm saying no in different ways. I'm saying no in different languages. And you can tell it's not registering in his head. And he just lines me up, right? <laughs> and just hit me as hard as he could with his fucking head, bro. <laughs> he yeah, knocked me completely unconscious. Only been knocked out oh, twice shit. in my life. Once was actually about three weeks ago when I fell under the sofa when I was wrestling with some children. The other time was when this dude, the self-proclaimed headbutt champion of the world, fucking put that one-hit sleeper on me, bro. Here's the crazy part. He didn't even touch me with his hands. <laughs> Did he leave the vodka at least? He didn't even dip t- out. Huh? Everything was gone, dude. Everything was gone. He's homeless, though. Yeah. That's the champ, though. How, <laughs> that's, the how, that's the champ. Yeah, how many people can say he got knocked out by the champ? It's a, kind of an honor, man. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and my first thought was, that dude is the champ. <laughs> That's my first thought. That's the champ right there. No doubt that man's the champ. champ right yeah. there. Hey, hey, Chin, bring up headbutting uh, champ of the world. Obviously, yeah. he's not going to be on there, but I think it's a real competition. <laughs> really? Have you ever seen the, the slapping contest? Oh, yeah. We used to do that, put sugar in each other's mouths and try to slap it out. Really? Yeah. This guy, epic headbutting king uh, of the world. That guy looks like a rapist, honestly. Yeah. A little Epic bit. Epic headbutting and king JPEG. of the world. All right, let's see it. And I'm guessing off a of JPEG right there. <laughs> JPEG. Oh, he has a solid forehead on him. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that guy's Dutch, He looks boy. like you. Piss him off. You heads butt somebody, they're going down. <laughs> I don't want none oh of my that. God. This looks like something Joe Rogan would put up on Instagram, does this it? This is like some shit Brian would do. Yeah. But like literally training Brian's it. Brian's like, yeah, uh, my family's from Zimbabwe. <laughs> I have very uh, uh, short uh, tongue. 
because we uh, used to eat uh, uh, berries off the vine. <laughs> <laughs> Not a good impersonation, really. Oh, here's a guy headbutting an animal. A Bichon, hopefully. Is that a Bichon? What's a Bichon? Oh, the, yeah. Dude, this video all looks absolutely amazing. This one? Oh, he has a helmet on. Oh, yeah. oh that's a goat. Oh, you're about yeah, to get fucked goat. up by a goat. Oh. oh. It's kind of fucked up to do the goat. Oh. <laughs> this shit is spicy, Dude, that goat, goat's fucking him up. 24 to 36, hut. Oh, this, oh, damn, this is in Louisiana. Oh, they're auditioning for something. <laughs> Oh, dude. That's cute. This motherfucker's trying to make ridiculous. Bro, win- winner gets to fuck somebody at the house, I bet. <laughs> this thing. Dude, that's awesome, though. What animal? Ooh. Oh, wow, that's got- that looks pretty fun. You hear the mom? So I'm about to get a headache. <laughs> Thank you, mom. Thank you. Uh, go back, Jen. Go to the World Star Hip Hop Headbutt comp- uh, compilation right there. And this man. Oh, yeah. You know, oh, a, good he- a good headbutt, right though, a solid headbutt oh, will took- fuck your world oh, up. Oh, it took me out. <sighs> God, I wish there was a video of you getting knocked out with a headbutt. They didn't have video back then. There was a drawing of it, I think. I told my <laughs> buddy and he drew a picture of it. Some Look people, some people lesbian, think you should huh? legalize headbutts in the UFC. What? I think this is a fake video. <laughs> oh, they're illegal? Hell yeah, they're illegal. This is the worst fight, this dude. This is the worst yeah, is the fucking worst. shit I've ever seen. And those pants seen. that person's wearing. God, God, that's dude, yeah. That is not a world star hip hop. What pants would you fight in if you had to fight, dude? In pants? Yeah. Jeans. All really? Day. Like these. Mm-hmm. These are a little stretchy, but they cover everything I need to cover. But they're not too baggy either, you know? And they're tight. <laughs> oh, you're going to get fucking worked if you were in about all of Yeah, that. and they're tight in the ankle, you know? That's what I want. Damn, boy. I was ready for that, right? <laughs> yeah, you were, dude. Oh my Dude, god. Headbutting These... so oh god. stupid. This is so Russian. Yeah, this is some Russian shit. The slapping competition though, I don't get how people don't get um, most of them do, they just get knocked the fuck out. Yeah. Too yeah. tough for their own good. You ever yeah. been slapped really hard? Mm, I think let me think of what happened. A girl slap? If a yeah. dude slap you, I I feel like it's more embarrassing than a punch. I'd rather get punched than a slap. This dude named Wade slapped me one time. Fat Wade was his name. <laughs> Why'd Wade slap you? Uh, you know, he just didn't have much to say, and he was angry for years, and it finally came out in a big slap. <laughs> and his daddy drove the school bus. His dad was named Milford, and his dad drove the school bus, and he was Irish. I guess he was Irish. I don't know. He never really said anything. Wade does, and Milford don't sound very Irish. <laughs> That's true. Good point. Yeah. So they might not have been Irish, dude, but they looked really Irish. They had a lot of <laughs> Irish characteristics for not being from there. And they uh, and Milford drove the bus, dude. And so Regular we get bus on there. or short bus? Regular, dude. Word. Full. And uh, I never rode short. Actually, one time I rode short, but just to talk to the driver was hot as fuck, dude. Really? Dude, we had the finest short bus driver in you our region. You pretended you were kind of slow just to get on that short bus? Oh, dude, I'd get on there. One of my buddies, right, he thought he was trying to be handicapped on there. He tied his legs together, right, and made like a long... Like Forrest Gump style? Yeah, and he tried to pretend he had one leg. Like, dude, that's not how you pretend you have one leg. Like, you tie one leg behind you or something. You just like like a mermaid? Yeah, yeah. You're not a mermaid. Yeah. You fucking idiot. I'm like, you look like a fucking idiot, dude. <laughs> be a mermaid. Two legs. Yeah. <laughs> He had two legs just she, tied together. It probably worked because she was like, look at this dumbass. Yeah. yeah, go ahead and get on the bus. Get in the back. She's probably like, I bet this boy's got a dick on him, you know? Because <laughs> I would think that if I saw somebody with one big ass thick leg, boy. You think you'd have a fat dick in the front? They have to be. They say that people that are 5'11 have big dicks. That's what I've heard. Some girl told me that. Why 5'11? She just said if you're 5'11 or shorter or like 5'9 to 5'11, you have like a fat dick syndrome. <laughs> fat and short? Yeah. Like you ever seen the, that uh, documentary on HBO? It's called uh, like Night Women or something like that. It's on prostitutes. Mm-mm. And they mic this one prostitute up. It's my favorite scene <laughs> ever in a documentary. Because they mic her up and she gets in a car with a John and he go, she goes, all right, baby, get it out. And they're like negotiating the price. She goes, all right, baby, get out. And then you just hear, you hear silence. And then you hear slurping. Then you hear her go, ooh, you got that, ooh, you got that short fat dick. <laughs> <laughs> and it was subtext, like subtitles. It says, ooh, you got that short fat dick. My favorite scene ever, man. Yeah. To view that dude, like, fuck you, yeah. bro. Fuck you, man. That wide dick's a heater, man. I came in wide, bro, when I was young, and I remember it takes almost all the blood out of your body. You can't even think that well when you get an erection. Like a like a like one of those short Coke cans, you know, that to give the kids. Not a full <laughs> yeah, one. Yeah. The short one. Yeah. Short and fat. Yeah. 
Is yours a full Coke can now or? Yeah, I mean, I got it. I mean, it's, yeah, but I'm more like, I'm definitely more of a width than a length guy. You know what I'm saying? Like, you see my dick, you're like, oh, I'd put a watch on that, you know? Oh, word. But you don't see it and be like, oh, you know, that thing. Uh, Give me a ruler. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you don't think that yeah. as much. Give me a tape measure. No, no. Yeah, I got that young attack artist, bro. I got that chubby and the fucking, you know, I got Napoleon's kind of taller, chubby brother, but still <laughs> you one know of Napoleon's what? You got that brothers. that chubby dick. <laughs> Dude. No, you get the chub dick, the chubby. Well, my dick couldn't really wear a turtleneck because it doesn't really have a neck. It's just all. It's just, oh, you got basically uh, the cankles of dick. Yeah, yeah. There's, no, yeah. there's no middle ground. It's just yeah. a solid It's piece. just cankle to head, bro. It's almost. Yeah, cankle dick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cankle it's dick, like bro. Jared Lorenzen that used to play for University of Kentucky. Bro, if you can pull him up. Fucking <laughs> you know runs. who he is? 300 pound quarterback. Yeah, went to the Giants. Lasted like one season. They're like, bro, yeah, we just yeah, can't yeah. anymore. That motherfucker for Kentucky had a cannon. Have you seen him lately? Oh, yeah, Playing dude. some low, low league? Yeah. There he is. He's out there right oh, there. Yeah, throwing there, there a waffle into his cousin's mouth right there. <laughs> that motherfucker is huge and could slang that football. <laughs> that. There is in college. In, there he is right there. In college, he was an animal. He was solid for sure. But yeah, man, that put that man put me unconscious, dude. Headbutt champ. God. And he was a champ, and I never saw him again, and he took that liquor, and that was it. Hopefully, you know... Hopefully he just... Oh, he's... I've, I've guaranteed he's dead. He's dead for sure. This boy's close to dying, too. He's 500 pounds now? Wow. Wow. There he is right there trying to rip into a bag of chips. What's that third picture right there <laughs> on the right? You know what? I'd assume he has a cankle dick as well. You know what's funny? His... Oh, that's hilarious when he made that. Uh, he came to a show one time and brought me a, a shirt when I performed in Lexington. Oh, really? Yeah, and it says straight out of uh, Lexington. It's pretty cool. He's, a, ni- he's, he's a nice, he's a nice guy. Yeah, super nice. But yeah, I mean, he makes fun of himself all the time. I mean, he's... It, well, there's nobody who's built like him. No, playing quarterback? Ever. Yeah. He's playing a left tackle playing quarterback. Yeah, people like him play marbles or play... Uh, Dungeons and Dragons. Get in! Get yeah. in there! <laughs> Get in there! Tell you this right now. Yeah, 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 yeah. Watch your tone. Uh, okay. What's gonna happen? What are you gonna do? Use some of that <laughs> boxing you've been doing. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you fucking disrespect. <laughs> hey. Hey.